Thank you so much, sir, for taking out the time to talk to us. Uh, you know, I mean, when we talk about FMCG and when we talk about consumption, uh, rural demand has been somewhat kind of seeing a slowdown. So could you just give, help us understand as far as go consumer is concerned, uh, you know, how is that demand being seen at least for the next financial year? Yeah, no, I think the purpose of this conference is not Godrej consumer, but the industry. And the industry is, for some time now, has not been seeing great uh, volume growth. And I think we're all talking about what is it that needs to be done to revive growth. Because it's not like the Indian, I think the big thing from today is it's not like the Indian economy is not growing. So what does FMCG need to do better in order to uh, get rural demand up? So it's not so much of when will rural demand come, but what will we do to get rural demand up? But sir, exactly, what about the factors that will drive this growth? I think one of the big factors that will drive this growth, two factors, I think one is affordability of products and two is distribution of our products into rural retail. So, you know, many of these new players are coming up, especially in the consumption space, when you talk about beauty and personal care, you know, and others. So how do you as an established player or even the traditional established players trying to, you know, keep up with that new entrance? No, I think the uh, new entrants have always been coming into FMCG. There's nothing new about it. I think new entrants bring in a lot of energy. They bring in a lot of innovation. And they are very good because it makes the, uh, the established players become more nimble-footed and more innovative. Sir, uh, you know, when uh, you have plans to set up a plant in Chennai, any update on that? You know, this is not the right forum for me to talk about GCPL. I'm happy to talk about CII in any way. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir.